and welcome to today's video. Now you may realise if you didn't see my last video that um, I have moved. I'm actually in a different location to normal. I'm actually in my new house which I'm super excited about. Um, oh, everything's in boxes, everything's all over the place so I've made myself a little temporary set going on here. So I really hope you guys like it but just to explain why I look a little bit different just in case you missed my last video. Anyway on to today's video and this is basically my May non-beauty monthly favourites. That makes any sense. So basically um, last week I did my beauty favourites, today is, well this week is my um, non-beauty favourites, so everything non-beauty I've been loving during May. Hope that makes sense. So let's get started because we've got quite a lot to get through. Um, okay, the first thing, let's start off with something really, really sweet. I love this. So this is basically um, a makeup bag. I, I guess you could say a makeup bag. It's kind of a, you could use it as a clutch bag, you could use it as a whatever bag you like. But I'm using it as a makeup bag. So if I open it up, oh, you can see all my goodies inside. I'm just going to do it back up though because otherwise they'll fall out everywhere and that's not cool. So this is by Gigi New York and it's kind of like a, um, I don't know if this is faux leather but it's really pretty and it's just super soft and it's got this little nice tassely bit. Kind of reminds me almost a bit like um, Rebecca Minkoff, that sort of style and I'm absolutely obsessed with that. So I just really like it and it's also nice that it's tanned because it means that if I get makeup on it and makeup on my hands when I pick it up it's not going to be a problem, it's not going to stain like super easy and I just love the gold on it as well, it makes a really pretty purchase so I love that. Okay then moving on to a candle. Who doesn't love candles? I do. Uh, so this is by um, Bath and Body Works, my fave, and this is actually the Lavender Vanilla Scented Candle. I cannot even tell you how amazing this smells. So my sister got this for me when she went over to LA not so long ago, and um, I usually get the big three wick ones, but they'd actually run out, so I was like, no, I'd ask her to pick me some up. And so she got this little one for me, and she got me three of them, so sweet. And they're um, blue, um, just really pretty, just kind of in the bathroom or around the house, and they've actually just got one wick in this one but the smell is absolutely insane it's so beautiful it lasts for ages and I am burning this to the death at the moment even though it's not really gone down that much I love it so good okay then moving on let's go to um, bath stuff now these are really really cute I love these these are actually from a local store I'm going to show you a couple at a time a local store in Nottingham and they were actually called um, who are actually called Cabela so um, they basically look how cool they are they're like little jam jars almost or little jars um, with handles on, love them, and then these screw top lids with, that looks really weird, it looks like a Katy Perry kind of uh, video going on here, but anyway, <laughs> um, so it's got some straws coming out of the top, so it looks like little drinks and I absolutely love them, um, but what they actually are are bath salts, so they're actually filled with bath salts, so here we have Himalayan sea salts, then these ones are just natural sea salts, and then the last ones are green tea sea salts and I'm just obsessed with these. They smell incredible, you pop them in the bath, but equally if you just want to have them on show, they are super pretty and I'm sure they'd be really easy to make at home as well. So um, maybe do a bit of DIY on some um, jam jars or whatever you might have lying around, but I just thought that was really pretty. So for the new house, when we do um, home tours, you will be seeing these in our bathroom. Absolutely love them. Okay, then let's move on to um, a clothing bit. So um, first of all, a lovely sports bra. Who doesn't love a sports bra in their life? This is actually for really low impact sports though. So this is actually for things like yoga, Pilates, that sort of thing. Um, this is from Sweaty Betty and it's a really pretty corally colour. Love it. It stands out. It's super bright. It's got no support whatsoever though in. It's really thin. So if you are a lovely busty lady and lucky enough to have that, probably won't do for you because it might not have enough support. But um, I just really like it. I don't exactly have small boobs myself. Um, and I just really like it. I find it really comfortable because it's just nice not to have too much padding all the time. And then at the back, um, it's actually just material. Sorry, I'm choking. Oh, I'm getting so excited. It's actually just material on the back. So I'm really excited about this because it's just so nice just to be able to kind of lie on the floor and not be stabbed in the back by a bra clasp or whatever. It's just so annoying. So this is really good for me when I'm doing yoga and really low impact stuff. I love it. Okay, then moving on. These are so cute. I actually got these from one of you guys called Katie. So hi Katie if you're watching. This is so, so sweet. I love these. Um, these were basically a little present that she got for me. She got me a bag of goodies and at Beautycon and I just absolutely loved it. So anyway, oh, look at all these little socks. They're so cute. And also, um, they have pugs on them. Oh, so sweet, so I can like wear Penelope. Although it's a fawn pug, but it's still a pug, so I love it. 
Um, these ones are pink, they've got flowers on, a little perk, and then a little love and perk, oh, because I love perks. And then um, just some little flowery ones. They are so cute and so thoughtful, so I love these, Katie. Thank you so much for these. I've been wearing them already a lot. Okay, next, a slight insight into my bedroom and maybe the sorts of colours that I'm going for. So I'm just going to show you two pillows. I have got a few of each, but I'm just going to show you two. So this is a bit of a secret kind of peek. Oh, I'm going kind of grey, I think. So this one's like checkered, which is really nice. And then this one's just a normal sort of grey. If I can kind of move around, you'll be able to see them both because they're rather large. Um, these are just for my bed. So this is the kind of theme that I'm going for. They're both from Dunnell Mill, which I'm obsessed with as a store. If you guys want any home stuff, it is incred. I'm going to go with Incred, definitely, I'm going to be down with the kids. Um, and they're just super pretty and just liven up a boring bedspread, so I love those. Okay, then next let's move on to um, an item of clothing. I'm actually going to show you a picture of me wearing this because it will make a lot more sense. But um, this is basically by River Island and because it's white it doesn't really show up that well which is quite annoying. But it's basically like a tailored waist, well I say it's tailored, it's kind of like quite a loose fitting waistcoat um, but it's sleeveless. So you can see you've got like the, the kind of waistcoaty bit going all the way down um, with the folds on the, on the cuff or whatever it's called on the shirt collar bit of collar there we go not a cuff on the collar bit there and then um on the back it has um just really cute a kind of like tie bit at the back so you can kind of see it's just got like a bit of detailing i really like this i tend to wear it over um it's very nice like nice for summer spring time that sort of thing where you don't really have to be worrying about you know layering up and keeping nice and toasty but looking lovely this is like nice and casual during the day but also i dress it up at night i wear it a lot with things like i'm wearing today like a black top and then black jeans just with like ripped jeans or whatever um, and then I obviously wear some kind of I could wear sandals during the day like flip-flops or I could dress it up at night while we're putting a pair of heels with it so possibilities are endless and I just really like it I've worn this load since I bought it and um, I'm all about monochrome so that's good so next let's um, next I say finally this is like the most epic thing in the world I love it I'm not sure whether the laxon came from there, but anyway. This is from Dunnell Mill as well. I was house shopping and I was super excited because I saw this in the sale and I was like, oh my God, I need that in my life. So basically, this is like a massive teddy bear fluffy onesie. <gasps> it doesn't have any feet, but I'm just gonna show you basically, it's like fleece. It's like a fleecy goodness and it's just beautiful. Um, but anyway, it's super baggy as well, by the way. You look about 20 times your own size, but it's really cute. I love it. It's just like a teddy bear. This is the best bit. Look at the hood. Wait. Oh, how amazing is that? I look like a proper little teddy bear. You could literally sell me it. Let's go for Harrods because I'm aiming up. So I'm aiming high. Um, but yeah, how cute is that? It's so nice and comfortable and so nice and toasty. So at the moment, I know it's kind of warm outside in the UK, um, but I just love this, especially in the winter. I'm gonna be wearing this bad boy all the time. And um, I bought it home. I do realize I'm still wearing it, so I'm just gonna take it off. Um, I bought it at home and Becky was like, my sister, she was like, Oh, I really want one of those. I was like, I know, I'm so excited. I love it, it's so nice and toasty. So that's everything. I really hope you guys enjoyed my monthly favorites and everything that I've loved during May, non-beauty related. Um, if you guys have got anything that you've been absolutely loving, comment below and let me know, because I love, love, love to hear from you guys. If you want to check out my last video, which was my monthly favorites beauty edition, then click on this pillow right now and that will take you back through to the last video so you can keep watching more of this face. In the meantime, give this video a massive thumbs up for me and of course subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already and I will see you guys in a few days time in my next video. Bye! Look at the cute little packaging on this. Oh, I love it. This is basically um, lip lacquer. It's like a lip lacquer trio. So it's a really cute little set. Obviously you could have it for yourself, just saying. Um